took out this whole top piece here over my uh, trunk lid and cut out a big section of it and I got up some pieces of MDF for the amps to mount to and then I'm gonna go out and get some fleece cover up this and then fiberglass it so I'll have four audio coup 750s up there Hopefully it'll turn out nice. First time really playing with a fiberglass and such. Kind of nervous. I already broke this piece. It's like really cheap plastic. It's like, you know, cracks really easy. So I'm cutting right along and then bam, it just cracked on me. So maybe I'll be able to fix it with the fiberglass, but who knows. Also ended up taking out the third brake light. But I'll probably end up putting like some LEDs inside there or something. So. I'll go out and get some fleece, cover this with fleece, and then I'll uh, do a layer of resin, pop the whole thing out of here, and then uh, you know build up the fiberglass mat and resin and bondo, and then paint it and put it back in. Hope, hope that it fits still. So I'm excited. There's no more six by nines there anymore. Sitting out there, just all smashed them. So. I don't know where I'm going to put 6x9s, maybe with these back doors. So I have a new set of Pioneer 6x9s, never got around to putting it. Stretched fleece over it. You know, fiberglassed it in there. Now I'm working on hardening it up from the back side and get, get it nice and strong. But it's pretty pretty good so far. It's a little bit you know weak, but get a couple layers of resin and fiberglass on the back here and I'll go through and do all all the edges all the way around. Put it, try to get it between there, but hopefully it'll be pretty strong when I'm done. And picked up some bondo, so I'll get to play with that a little bit here too. So, kind of exciting, you know. Never really played with fiberglass before. I got got a different kind of fiberglass mat this time. It's more like hairs. The other stuff was different, but. Yep, so hopefully I'll uh I'll be slamming soon. The other two amps are on order, so should be here soon and I'll hopefully I'll be all set for it. Got wire coming. Just gotta put my terminals in the box, do a little more fiberglassing inside the box, seal it off a little better, you know, sanding, paint it and it'll be good. Should be good to go. Alrighty, so uh, yeah, messing around a little more with my little amp rack here. Uh, got half of it like bondo and stuff. I reinforced the back side with some mat and stuff like that. But, yeah, first time playing with bondo. It's a treat, you know. Pretty fun stuff to work with. Easy to easy to work with. You know what I mean? So yeah, it's exciting. It's a little bit a little bit dusty. I mean, you know, really, really dusty, but, you know, it comes with it. It's all part of the experience, I guess. So, yeah, I ran out of Bondo, and then we got rained out, you know, you know what I mean? So, huh, that's funny, it looks like the uh, headlight on that car is on, but really it's the, uh, the light on the phone. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, so, yeah, uh, hopefully here soon I'll be able to finish this up, get my amps on it, things like that. And uh get bumping. Ordered have all almost have all four amps and stuff like that, so I'm excited. Alright, so uh just finished night number two working on this uh amp rack here. Well, you can see all the dust in the air. My face is just like covered in it and stuff, but looking pretty good. Took me about ten minutes to put the bondo on and I sanded it for about two hours. <laughs> I still got some uh, little things to fill in couple things like that but it's coming together nice I like it it's looking good just put this bondo on not too long ago and this stuff up here I gotta sand that down too but it's starting to look pretty good I have faith that uh, we can finish it and you know bang this out so yeah
Just got some uh, another hundred square foot of fat mat too, so excited about that. I can finally do my doors. Uh, I'm done for the night. All right, so yeah, look at this. Got it all uh, primed up. You know, it's not done yet, but got got myself a layer of primer on it. You know, so I can see kind of the high spots, low spots, whatever. It's a little wavy right now, but kind of sand it down a little more. Got some. Got to fix the edges a little bit. A little more sanding. Maybe with some finer grit. But not looking too bad.